Hi everyone, this is Kathy Grosskirch with Bookkeeping Clean and Simple here in Austell, Georgia near Metro Atlanta. And today I want to demonstrate how to connect Milio Bill Pay within QuickBooks Online. And as you can see here, I am in my QuickBooks Online Accountant Portal. And the file that I want to connect is my Kathy Bookkeeping Test File which prior to this I went ahead and copied the file name exactly as it is shown here because that's going to be important. Now I did kind of go through a trial run of this without actually connecting anything at this point because I wanted to go ahead and do this demo live and for the purposes of what we're doing here we're actually connecting to a client file that's within your client QBOA platform so basically what I'm going to do here is in the clients area, I'm going to go from that tab to the apps tab. And as you can see, I've already, when I go over here to the firm apps, I've already connected the Melio app to the QBOA portal that I'm using here. And so all I have to do is to launch the Melio Pay and it's going to open up a separate tab. And since I have those linked, then basically all I need to go to at this point is to over here where it says clients and click on clients. And as you can see, I have attempted to add an initial client, which I haven't finished with that setup as of yet, but I'm going to go ahead and click over here on the new client button because I want to add that new client, which is my test file. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. Now this is where when I said I copied the name, I'm going to go ahead and paste that name here. So that way it matches what I have in my client file here. And I'm going to go ahead and use the email address. And what this is going to do is it's going to check to see if there's already an active Milio account for this file with this email address. So once I click on continue and it's going to discover that there is a QuickBooks file for this particular one. So I'm going to go ahead and click yes, connect their QuickBooks here and we're going to see what happens. And then when you get to that point, I guess you go over here and select the company or firm. And then I'm going to search for that client in here. There we go. And then I'm going to go ahead and click on next. And it's going to tell us by selecting connect, we agree to share our information, blah, blah, blah. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that connect button here. And then it's going ahead and saying, look like there's already a Milio account for this. And then they're going to send them a request to add to their account. So I'm going to go ahead and say, got it, send my request. I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And the request has been sent. So I'm going to go ahead and pause that while we respond to that email. So it seems as if I cannot add that particular file to my company since I'm using the same email address as I am using for my firm. So that is something that I'm going to have to go back in and tweak and see if I can maybe set up another email address for that company. So let me go ahead and pause this again and see what I can do in the background and I'll be right back and let you know. Okay, so we are back and just wanted to let you know that I was able to connect the bookkeeping test file under, basically what I did is I changed the email address. So now it's linked and then basically what I've got to do is i got to fill out these other fields, it looks like, and go ahead and do that here. And I'm going to do most of this offline as well. So let me go ahead and pause this while I do that. Okay, so I skipped through some of the interview and I am up to the point where you add the bank account. So what I'm going to do is where you can see where you can add the bank account. Then it, it is free to do. 
So I'm going to go ahead and do that real quick. And it says that you can connect instantly and you can start the transfers right away or verify with deposits or you can connect using a debit card. Either one of those will work. So let's see if I connect instantly what it'll do. So we'll go ahead and use the connectivity and let's see if it'll have my LGE Community Credit Union and I have to supply those credentials so let me go ahead and do that real quick offline okay so I went ahead and entered the credentials and now I've got to get the text to send the security code so I'm going to go ahead and take care of that real quick So let me pause this again while I go grab that and put that in. So I just verified the phone number here and, and it's asking me, let me know which one to connect to. And it looks like it's connected to the right one. And it looks like we've been successful. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on continue. And so what is the account called in QuickBooks? You link that, it's LGE Checking, because it's already in there, and we can link the accounts. And we want to invite Kathy to this account. Let's just go ahead and just click on Yes. And do we want to approve payments uh, above a certain amount? Uh, we can just put No for now and continue. And then we're all set. And so I'm going to get an invite to this account, uh, probably through my firm email address, and go ahead and get started. And as you can see, we're back to the Melio firm's client screen, and it looks like everything is set up the way that it needs to be. And probably what I'll do maybe next time I want to pay a bill and demonstrate that out of Melio is I'll go over here and do it out of the Kathy's book keeping test file. And the be beautiful thing about Melio, it's, it's free. So when, when you hook it up in the way that I did. So anyway, hopefully this will help you today. Y'all take care. Have a wonderful day, everybody. Thank you for watching. I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel and share it with others. My goal is to publish at least one new video per week on QuickBooks desktop or online topics, the occasional motivational video, and a few surprises thrown in here and there. I would love to talk to you about how to help you optimize your knowledge and usage of QuickBooks desktop or online. My Calendly link is in the slide. Please use that to reach out to me to schedule a free 45-minute initial consult. I would love to talk to you about your QuickBooks desktop or online training needs. Again. Have a wonderful day, and until next time, we'll see you soon. Take care.